it's not a demon hiding under the bed or a dragon flying up in the air or a thief robbing your wife, stuff or fortune. The greatest enemy you will ever encounter and have to overcome is your very own brain. It's all the negative talk you do every day to yourself. See, every word spoken, every thought in your mind, every just attitude of being negative affects your very own body, affects your very own decision making and affects your very own brain. And it's proven that negative thoughts shift your brain in a way that it's not capable to learn anymore, that it's not capable to think clearly. So holding up negative self-talk, anger, hate, fear, depression, anxiety, all these negative feelings will destroy you biologically. So raise your God. There are always two nights within yourself fighting for your body, for your mind. You have to choose to feed the Black Knight, wanting you to stay where you are, not leaving your comfort zone, not raising above average because you could be hit by something. Or you choose to be the White Knight with his shiny armor and his attitude to move toward the goal and push everyone around them with it. You have to choose to feed your fears, negative self-talk or to feed your hope and faith. It's a decision we all have to make and if you're not careful, the Black Knight will win. The Black Knight is clever and hides so you can't see it directly. He whispers in the ear and counts on your weakness. The White Knight can only win if you support him. The White Knight can only lead you to your own greatness, to your dreams, success, everything you've ever wanted. If you realize you have to fight alongside the White Knight to defeat every black thought, every black word, every black attitude you have accumulated over the years. Every negative thought affects your own body and lets the black knight grow bigger. So choose to be the white knight, choose to be the hero of your own life and choose to be the person who fights for everything he stands for.